Oh, hey everybody, 650E here. Welcome home to the channel. Today I'm on the Moto Million M1000 Double R and riding with my good buddy Kyle from Ducati Cleveland. We have to put, or I have to put, break-in miles on this motorcycle because if you remember, this is the machine from Moto Million that got a new engine recently installed by Zach, the master mechanic. And now we have break-in miles to do. Zach wants to see 1,040 miles on this machine. I just paired my Pack Talk Edge, by the way, um, before he will remove the rev limit. And as you can see, we have 449 miles. Oh boy. <laughs> this thing is rowdy when it starts up because it doesn't have the brain tuning ECU flash on it. It's loud. Woo. It'll settle down in a second. Wow, and all of that noise and drama is coming from that beautiful SC Project exhaust. But uh, we're gonna see how the day goes and how far we can get and how many miles we can put on this machine because I have to deliver this motorcycle to Southern California to the private residence of our good buddy, Jim Caviezel because he purchased his bike from Miami Manny at Moto Million. But of course, before I can deliver it to Jim, there's Kyle, we have to get the break-in miles done. And also, Jim ordered some really nice parts for his machine from Moto Million, carbon fiber fuel tank, carbon fiber beautiful subframe, and we shall reinstall the carbon fiber OEM wheels onto this machine, removing the OZ racing wheels and surrendering them to Moto Million. So, time is of the essence for us to get all this done. And it looks like that it's in my hands at this point. So if I don't get the break-in miles on this bike uh, in a timely fashion, then Jim may not get his machine for uh, for a little while because he's starting a new motion picture in June and I have to get this bike to him sometime during the month of May. Man, I love the way that Kyle's bike looks, his beautiful Ducati shoes, and his pistol that he's packing. <laughs> Nobody better, mess, better not mess with us today. That's a nice little, little weapon he's got there. Can somebody in the comments tell me exactly what make Kyle's weapon is just by looking at it right here? I would not be surprised if someone could figure it out. I'm trying to get close so you can see. Is it a Ducati pistol? I don't know. Between a bunch of trucks, one of them is carrying sweet onions. The other one hauling who knows what in the fast lane of all places. I told him I'm getting over. <laughs> I like some of those sweet onions. This thing won't go any faster. It just won't go any faster. It won't go any faster. We gotta get this rev limit removed so that we can have some fun on the Caviezel machine. And so I rode today from filthy Cleveland to Pittsburgh and that is a beautiful view. Hi guy. That is a beautiful view of downtown Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. And we're headed to a, a spot called the Mount Washington Scenic Overlook. I'm not sure if you've stopped here en route to your children's university or not, but this is a great place for you to stop and take pictures and generally just enjoy it. There's a tram vehicle that goes up there. And uh, in a few moments, we will be at the scenic overlook right up there. If you could see where the uh, big bump on the road, where that platform is, that's where we're going to be 
and I'm going to try to position your motorcycle in Kyle's Ducati Pinigale V4 next to each other. There's another platform. There's several of them, Mr. Caviezel, where we can try to put our bikes to take some scenic pictures. And it looks like our timing is just right because Monday at 6, hi buddy, you're hardly, Monday at 6 in the evening, apparently there's not too many people there. So we should have a good opportunity for a decent photo shoot. But look at these views. Sometimes I bring my DJI Mavic Pro 2 drone and I launch it over here to get some spectacular images. I didn't bring my drone today, but uh, I come here once or twice a week. It takes about an hour and 15 minutes to get here. Look at that view. And so uh, it's no big deal for us to, to get here. So we're going to try to put our bikes over here for some photography. Look at that. Look at that, Jim. It doesn't get any better than this, does it, sir? I challenge you to find set views in California, if you would. That was a lot of fun riding this M1000 today, putting some break-in miles on it so that in the future, we can ride it without any rev limits or anything of the sort. Such a great bike, makes me miss mine quite a bit. And I am eagerly looking forward uh, to getting mine back from Miami Mandy at Moto Million, who installed a whole bunch of awesome parts onto it. So it's gonna be awesome. These skyscrapers are so clean, so beautiful.